about it. You can feel this rich history. And I think it's like the oldest music hall in Europe or something. I mean, that may not be true, but it's, it's very old and they're doing loads of great um, repair works on it and it's proper legit. And the breeze and the trees and the whispering to be back in London. I consider London my home away from home. You know, I grew up in Ohio, but I've spent the better part of my adulthood in London. So I really just gel with the vibe here, gel with the people. My mother's British as well, so I kind of have it somewhat ingrained within me, I suppose. Feed the flame. Actually, my, my, my earliest kind of passion for music started with punk and hardcore music. Seeing that kind of music live when you're in the mosh pit, crowd surfing, you know, there's nothing like that, the energy of that kind of live show. I'd like to think that my connection with punk rock is, is part of what I bring as well to the folk music. It may not be apparent in how it sounds, but I think that energy and that, um, that need to, to explore that is probably there somewhere, who knows. I also, you know, love good hip hop. I love jazz. I love I love good music. I'm just I'm, I'm a bit of a connoisseur. I, I I worked in a record store for about five years when I lived in Ohio. I still kind of like to investigate new music. I listen to as much new stuff that's coming out as I can from many different genres. So it's really hard for me to pinpoint what my exact influences are because they're kind of eclectic. But yeah, it's kind of it in a nutshell. Yeah, I'll be a bigger, more better. Give me a reason, give me a reason. This sunny season, my mind is broken. I'm stuck for it. Well, we recorded this EP in literally two days up in Sheffield at Tesla Studios. It was the only time I had off that summer, so I was like, let's get in there and let's get this done. And Danny Keir, who um, works for uh, Sound Diplomacy, he's basically the one who really helped me to get my shit together and spearhead the recording of the CP. We called upon a number of his friends to, to get in there and help out with the recording. Um, David Glover and um, Adam Crofts and um, Alex Eichenberg are, are playing with me tonight and they also played on the record. So we've got this little kind of super group of people together and we've got Charles Watson from the esteemed Slow Club, which is an excellent band from Sheffield. And, I'm just so chuffed that they've all wanted to come together and, and do the show with me and um, the sound is pretty amazing and I'm just so happy to have a band together and hearing my songs fleshed out. It's like there's nothing like hearing that happen. If he could raise his voice, they fly away. Outside all, old dollars to keep the balance. It's not me, it's you. Tonight I'm going to do a, um, a solo acoustic set beforehand. I'm going to do, I don't know, seven songs or something like that. I'm going to throw in a little Elvis cover because it's his birthday today. Roll over in your grave, Elvis. <laughs> I played Elvis in the West End. Um, for about a year, you know, eight shows a week, singing uh, 1956 Sun Records style Elvis, which was amazing. And um, that sort of segues into why I decided to really start pursuing the music. I mean, I, I recorded music for, I've recorded music for something like 10 years now, just myself, you know, just on GarageBand or to my phone or whatever, and I'd just send these tracks off to family and friends. and. Too many people just started saying, you know, I, 
I'd buy that stuff. You know, why don't you, why don't you do something with it? So I kind of started to you know, flirt with the idea of maybe putting something out and then obviously meeting Danny, he really helped me to, to um, get that moving. But I think it was a lot of it was down to doing that show, Million Dollar Quartet, that um, boosted my confidence to, to feel like I could actually do this. I'm going to start with a, a little um, solo acoustic set and then we're going to bring the band out and, and play the EP from front to back, which I'm excited about. So it's going to be good and this is the first time we have the record available as well. It literally just came in, I've seen it in the box and I'm like, ah, there it is. Maybe I'm legit now. Woo! But no, it's great. There's some merch, there's some t-shirts and some um, tote bags and posters and stuff and everything looks great. It's all very well done. And I'm just pleased to be able to share the music with people. Yeah, well, hey, it worked out, I suppose. I don't know what I'm supposed to say, but <laughs> fuck yeah. All right, here's to the future. Right yeah. on. Cheers, guys. Cheers. 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 And the breeze and the trees and the whisper your name. You make me feel like a kid. You make me feel like a man. You're my head, When the bells still. Just remember that we love in many different ways That will fight for this I'm here to stay You're my everything And the bells still Thank you so much, man. I love you guys. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. See you in the spring.